Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to tell you something about how thermometers work. Well, first of all, there are different types of thermometer, but all thermometers need something that changes when temperature changes. Now, we know that things expand when temperature changes, and therefore liquids expand in the same way. And the two liquids used are mercury or alcohol, but nowadays more often it's alcohol, and these are called liquid in glass thermometers and look something like this. So the liquid in glass thermometer has a large bulb at the bottom, so there's a large amount of liquid and a very, very thin tube with a magnifying glass at the back. So that when you look at it, you can see how far up this liquid has gone. And because it's a large amount of liquid in the bulb at the bottom, it goes up this tube quite a long way, even though there is only a small expansion in volume. So this is a liquid in glass thermometer. Now, liquid in glass thermometers have been around for hundreds of years. But something newer are things called thermistors or basically electrical resistance thermometers. Now we know if we have a piece of metal that conducts electricity, we know the ability to conduct electricity depends on how hot it is. So the hotter it gets, the either the greater or lesser gets the resistance, depending on which metal it is. So this can be measured to act as a thermometer. So obviously if it gets hotter, the resistance goes up and a meter tells you uh, how much more resistance there is and therefore what temperature it is. The third type is something that's uh, fairly common nowadays. You buy it in the shops and you can put it on your forehead and it'll tell you your temperature. This is generally used for very inaccurate things, but it's a chemical strip and the chemicals react according to the temperature. So the colour of the chemicals depend on the actual temperature of the surroundings. And if it's on your forehead and therefore hotter, then it will light up the actual temperature which the uh, chemicals are designed to react at. So this is temperature sensitive strips. But remember, a thermometer is not something like this. A thermometer is simply a device which measures a change in size, colour, whatever, depending on the temperature. It's a physical change which gives you a measure of the temperature. And be careful because these actually have slightly different scales and if you're getting 49 degrees by this you might get 51 degrees on that thermometer. At the ends it'll be the same because you make them the same but in the middle they might be different so be careful. So this is a little bit about thermometers.